Alright guys, so today I'm going to be showing you how to make this. Enjoy the video. Sixteen penny vinyl nails. A drill bit that matches the size of your nail. Gloves. Safety goggles. Quarter inch thick steel or aluminum rectangle. A small tree branch. A wood chisel. Razor or hobby knife. Drill and a small saw. Alright, let's get started. Alright, after you get on your safety goggles and gloves, you want to shave the bark off the lock. I chose not to go down to the white part of the wood just for video making purposes. If you have any stubs on your wood, you can just saw them off or use a hammer. Next, clean up your area and get out your small saw. Cut a small groove in the top. Make sure the angle of the groove is correctly what you want it to be, because that is the angle that your blade will be at. Next, get out your hammer and chisel and make a crack large enough, but still tight enough that it will hold your blade in snugly. Then, hammer it in. And get out your drill and make three vertical holes on any side that you want it to be on. Make sure they go all the way through though. Once you're done with that, take it out and remove all the burrs. Realign it. This, will, this might take a while but you need your nails to be aligned with it so they can actually fit in so it's well worth your time once you're done with that put your nails in and then hammer them down at a 90 degree angle and then you're done here's the finished product here's the finished product it's um, very lightweight It'd be probably good, best for chopping down branches about uh, an inch to four inches wide. But uh, once you sharpen this thing, it'll be, it's really good for swinging, and it's pretty, it's pretty rugged looking and robust. So I think it was a fun project, and I'll probably do some other things like that. But thanks for watching. Bye.